thank God for you. sick. talkies instead. Cell phones are bound to go offline. Hey, I hear some people back here. You sure? Yeah, come on. Grab your gun. Let's do this.
like you did it. You're coming in loud and clear. Hey, think you could do something about the trash pickup next? No? Forget I said anything. Yo, this is Chris. Leave a message. Hey, asshole, where the hell are you? You were supposed to pick me up at the airport three hours ago. Thanks for that. I had to fight my way through a freaking mob to get on some shitty bus. What's up with that? You don't do cabs anymore? Anyway, all right, I should be at your place in half an hour. You better be awake by then. All right, later. If those antibodies... Hey, someone's a little jumpy. Hey, we've got too many people as it is. Enough! This is God's house, not yours. Please, everyone, come in. If God wills it, we'll find a way. 
We're all in this together. What, you don't speak English? If this is a joke, it's not funny. Like we have an old time on the line, Joseph Farrell. Hey, Joe, what's your take on the dollar flu? I think this really shows how vulnerable this country is. I mean, how stupid you have to be not to go to the hospital when you're sick as a dog. We got people going to work, to the supermarket, even to the goddamn movies, infecting thousands of other people out of. Active echo beacon detected. assignments for you today. Martinez. Yes, sir. Take your guys over to the Hudson Yards and bring one of the tankers. Kaczynski found a shanty down there that might require some crowd control. Make sure they don't run. Uh, Rogan. Yeah? There's a residential building uptown for you in Hell's Kitchen. It's pretty big, so make sure to cover the exit so no one gets out. There's a truck ready for you as well, but don't go crazy. I don't want to hear you burn the whole block down or nothing, okay? You got it. The rest of you, stick to your patrol routes. You never know what might be creeping back, even if you cleared it out yesterday. Now, let's go to work. All right, what do you have for me? Car crash on Madison. Huge pile up. Got some nice close-ups of the bodies, too. That's it? Well, yeah, it's good stuff. Blood and guts all over the pavement. You're wasting your time. We got hospitals, riots, sick kids. Get me some of that and you'll make the news. All right, I'll see what I can do. to us all. Maybe you should take a look at that power plant.
When he says he wants something done, he gets it done. What I like is that he's out here doing it with us. I had the shop boss once. He never left the freaking office. Fellow, he's out on the streets. Yeah, and he gets his hands dirty. Never ask a guy to do what he won't do himself. Ain't that the truth? He got himself a little bit of a temper, though. You gotta watch that. He gets this real easy to question the mission. Yeah, I guess you can say he's kind of a... Uh, <laughs> you get it? See what I did there? Ah, uh, screw you, I thought it was funny.
you doing good? Readings indicate an echo nearby. People act while the rules break down. Predators, protectors, they start looking an awful lot alike. Hard to tell them apart, don't you think? So, the fella who runs the convenience store around the corner, he wanted me to say thank you. And that goes for everyone I've talked to. And I've talked to everyone, you know. You've been a godsend. They'll be talking about you around here for years. And if me heart holds up, so will I.
Active echo beacon detected. After the last couple of days, I didn't expect anything good to happen, but it did. Miko was there. She recognized me, and she let me in. They live on the third floor and still have electricity. I'm writing now by the light of an actual electrical bulb. <laughs> Amazing how quickly that starts to seem unusual. Miko's partner, Drew, is a nurse. He's got some incredible stories about the first days of the bug. Neither of them can believe he's still alive. Every so often, while he's telling his stories, Miko will just reach out and touch him, like she wanted to make sure he was really there. I wish I could reach out and touch Bill. beds and an additional 25 now in the east wing. All in use? Yes, ma'am. With a wait list. And that's just the start of our problems. We've got staff shortages as well. We can barely take care of the main building. I know. It's the same story all over. Yeah. Sheriff's got their hands full. But we're barely functioning over here, and I'm afraid of the infection spreading to the other patients. Is there anything you can do to, I don't know, speed things up a bit? I'm sorry, sir. We're doing what we can. 